The Dozen Trivia Competition presented by High Noon returns for the final regular season match of Season 2. It's the experts rematching Spit and Chicklets for the first time since last season. 14-6-0 on the season. The OG Dozen team, Brandon, PFT, and Fran are taking on for the first time a team of three with the Chicklets, Biz, Wit, and R.A. Chicklets is 1-0-0 on the season and is playing their required second match in order to get into the tournament. Now, if they win, what seed will they be? It's the experts. It's Spittin' Chicklets and a dozen regular season finale all-stars right now. You guys have never won shit, though, right? Uh, we won the Arizona Bowl. Arizona. I'll punch you in the nuts. That's what I'll do. Oh. I bet you would want to touch my nuts. I'll yep. punch you right in the sack. <laughs> <laughs> all right, it's the dozen. Big one. Big one. Big, I'm leaving that part in. Match. The regular season finale. We're actually filming this before matches 195 through 199, but whatever. You're seeing this in order. Match 200 for only the second time. First time ever, Fran gets to play them. And first time, Wit will be playing them. It is the experts against Chicklets. This match brought to you by High Noon. This match of the Dozen Trivia Competition and the Road to the Dozen Trivia Tournament 2, all sponsored and presented by High Noon Hard Seltzer, the best hard seltzer in the game, made with real vodka, made with real juice, sparkling water, gets better. Only 100 calories, gluten-free, no added sugar, and again, actually made with vodka, but I got even better news somehow. Three new flavors, lemon. You can buy lemon by itself. Lemon, there's also a lime flavor, as we know. But two other flavors that you can get in a limited time, pool pack for the summer. Kiwi, delicious. It's got a great twist. And then guava. Last year they had passion fruit. This year they introduced guava, another new great tropical flavor. Get it in the pool pack. Spring is here. Summer's rolling right around the corner. Stock up. Get your high noon today. It's the only drink you will want this summer, especially when you're watching the end of the Dozen Trivia Competition Season 2 and the Dozen Trivia Tournament 2. All right. Last match of the season. I don't know what teams are ranked right. As we're recording this, Chicklets is ranked 13th, 1-0-0. Perfect Yikes. record. Only undefeated team in the league. How are you 13th if you're 1-0-1-0? It's pretty impressive to have only played one time. <laughs> but the teams ahead of you have won a couple more times than you. That, that's the problem. You're, if you win tonight, uh, we'll, you're going to have a pretty high ranking. Experts, you're currently, as we're speaking, six. I don't know where you're going to be uh, when this actually airs. But if you're watching right now, you see it on the screen. Brandon, the last time you played this team, PFTU as well, uh, it was just Biz and R.A. R.A. Brandon, I'll let you explain your thoughts on R.A. in that match. Well, I don't know what he was uh, enjoying, whether it was alcohol or something else. He was Rain Man. He was, he was Rain Manning answers I've never seen. He had no idea what the questions were. The answers were just popping out of his face. He was I locked in. He was dialed in. It was, it was, he didn't even think, know where he was. Like, best single-handed in performance life. in the history. Yeah. See, <laughs> I, I don't think R.A. even remembers that game. Like, you could ask <laughs> the exact same questions that you asked that night to R.A. Right? He probably wouldn't get as many right. Brain is a also, funny thing like that. Can we have can we have Biz put some underwear on just to make sure? <laughs> <laughs> Biz has his. Like you know how many times you know how many times RA on our, in our face. Do you, do you know how many times RA in the meantime has tried to recreate that night and, and try to <laughs> uh, mix all these different uh, alcohols and drugs to get back to that. You can it's never like his, get that big it, high again, it, right? It's Biz? like his it's own like... version of ayahuasca. <laughs> so we're we're gonna it. get it down and we're gonna figure it out and we're gonna get back to that place right now, RA. Let's find that go. rhythm, buddy. I'm I'm raring to go. Let's go. And send these. All right. So so we are these. just gonna stare at Biz's dick the whole time. Yeah. I'm oh, wearing a pair of shorts, I mean. <laughs> guys. I've been seeing a trainer. I've been talking about it on the. All right. Fair enough. I'm Let me hike them down a little bit here. Show a little care. less leg. Maybe I could tilt my camera up. Biz, it's rattling yeah. them. Don't change a thing. We want these guys on tilt. Okay, Wit sorry. before we start. Again, undefeated one zero and zero. Looking to go into the end of season playoffs. Maybe undefeated. You've, you've never played Brandon, PFT, and Fran before. No, I have a lot of respect for all three of those guys, but I know that besides the Arizona Bowl, which is basically like a fucking midseason, preseason trash event, mm -hmm. they've never won anything. So it's like mm -hmm. Brandon gets so pissed off 
And he'll get pissed off at people he plays against and his teammates. He's kind of a complete head case. I know PFT <laughs> probably got a million things going on in his head. And Fran, who knows, the bachelor could be on right now. Maybe she's got her mind somewhere else. Yeah. So this chick looks who's <laughs> ready to go. Yeah. Uh, they beat ZD. They beat Dave. ZD's the worst team in the league. <laughs> Doesn't help your resume to say that though. You just gotta say they're you gotta say they're fucking great. Um, True. Was that you won quad, that one. Experts, experts, your last match of the season as well. You will end with a winning record regardless if you're 14, 6, and oh, here we go. Uh RA, I assume your final answer person again for your squad. Yes. Brandon, you're back. You were absent last week, actually. I was uh real quick. I just have to say it. Uh PFT might want to say it. You can have it, PFT. No, I was just gonna say that like Jeff kind of glossed over it earlier today. Uh, but it's the 200th episode of this show. That's I don't know how many thousands of questions that have been asked and answered on the show. It's a lot of time commitment that's been given in to grow the show from nothing. So, Jeff, I just want to say thank you to Brandon Walker for mm-hmm. being around <laughs> through thick and thin mm-hmm. and carrying this show on his back. Thank you. Oh, Brandon. my God. Yeah, Quick we don't want to cry. We don't that's want not going to affect cry. the scoring and decision making, is it? After getting that double barrel wrister there, is it? I guess you just weren't paying attention. That's fine. No, he's yeah. business uh, comprehension is at a low right now. PFT, <laughs> are you are you finance? Oh, we lost. Our, we lost our A. Brandon, what do you, oh fuck! What, you, you know why? Because you told him to get like he was last time. He's on the corner meeting this drug <laughs> mule in Charlestown, stuck in dick for crack right now. It's shocking <laughs> that given the success of spitting chiclets, you guys can't figure out RA how to use a camera and wit how to use a microphone. So, um, you know, I, I wish you all the best success. <laughs> RA, are we are we back? Sorry. There we. All right, you can turn the camera on once you I hit can, the pipe. PFC, I can. We're gonna lose to him again. He's right. not gonna be able to figure out his camera, and we're gonna lose to him again. Right, there he right is. now. Oh, he threw a mer- He threw some merch on. <laughs> oh. Can you hear me, fucking Jeff. Sorry, dude. It's fucking. <laughs> Right now, the one that's got the best technological understanding of how to use a web conference is the guy that's pretty much showing us his uncircumcised. Can you hear me, Jeff? Fucking sorry, dude. Can the you covered hear Covered wagons. That should be our new team, wa- team name. <laughs> PFT, sorry, are Fran. you a bouncer person or is Brandon? Oh, Brandon. Brandon is. Okay. If that's okay with Fran. That I is okay with me, yes. Oh, you can't hear us? All right. Oh, no. Click on the settings button and then <laughs> audio. There's like a... Audio, you can press something. He's definitely going to be able to hear you say that. Audio, you can press something. I text him. Hey, friend, we're, we're, he understands me even if he can't hear me. It's like <laughs> Jeff, Jeff, on behalf of our team, I also wanted to thank you for all the hard work you've put in. Not so much for us because we've only played a few games of that. So all these, time. We'll give you just as big a thank you, even though we haven't ate up as much of your time as all the other groups associated to competition. No, So we, we're even here on the wristers. Okay. Very much noted. Who will I slant it to tonight? Uh oh. Brandon, does it kill you that Minahan's way better than you are? <laughs> oh I'd also like to well, say thank you to Gooch. I was good. You can hear us? <laughs> yeah. Okay, great. <laughs> I, don't know, I, don't, I don't know if I believe that. Here we go. All right. 24 questions, Take 12 two. rounds of trivia, three lifelines, double up. You can double up any category you want, except for round six. Mm-hmm. Uh, and then your call a friend and your double sip. Your double sip means you can answer a question two times. You can answer one question two times. You cannot pair those up with any question worth two points. Uh, so keep that in mind. Make sure you use your lifelines. Here we go. First up, every round is the experts. 35 seconds on the clock. First category is Major League Baseball. Love it. MLB, this is for the experts. Kurt Schilling debuted with this team this team. AL team in 1988 and had his official rookie season with them in 1990 as a reliever for the experts. 35 seconds. Easy. All right. So I just know that he was on the Phillies after that. Um, hmm. I know this one. Yeah. Same here. I think I know it. Yep. <laughs> Honestly, shocked. All right, I'm so I think Brandon he's, knows, and he's like trying to do this for the camera. Yeah, the yeah, exactly. He's, he's that kind of guy. He's got worried. He's not even there right now. Is, he f- is Brandon frozen? No. Nope. Oh. Five. Four. I think it's the Toronto Blue Jays. Three. Sure, go for it. Final. Yes. Baltimore Five. Orioles. Baltimore folks. Orioles. Finally, Baltimore yes. Orioles. Okay. One nothing, Chicklin. How do y'all know that? 
because I'm a Sox fan and I watched him with this bloody sock. And then I went back in his <laughs> career and watched what he did prior. It's all like a human being. I, I can't understand that shit. I'm old. <laughs> I'm old block. That's how I know. Other side. No, you know what? I had a baseball card. I thought it was. I thought it was. I should have known that. I thought it was the Expos. (laughs) They weren't even in the AL. Major Martinez debuted with this NL team in 1992 and had his official rookie season with them in 1993 as a reliever. 35 seconds. You were early. Yes, baby. The Expos two nothing bitches. No, what, what's that? What's that? Oh, wait, no, is it not? He was a no, starter for the Expos, you idiot. He was nasty for him. Good thing I'm not final answer. Great well, thing. Y'all already, so I know it is. Yeah, it, was, it, was, it, was, it was. It was. Fun. Could it be? Could it be the Mets? Is it, is it our turn? Or he's on the Mets yeah, later? Was, yeah. Yeah. Is it the Dodgers? Or Mets? All right, don't you? Five, is this you? Four. Go with the yeah. We go with just the Dodgers. answered wrong. Mets. Two. No, I'm not final answer. One. Yeah, but already, already answer. Mets. No. Dodgers. No, the Dodgers. No, wait. We, he said right before, we're already doing final answer. Like, you didn't say nothing. So, either way, whatever. We. Oh, but when I said expos that count, even though I'm talking, even though I'm not final no, answer, I thought I you said, could be like, no. Yeah, he, I, he, no, he final. I agreed with you. And I said, I thought so yeah. too. Oh, I was wrong. Sorry. I forgot it was Dodgers. So, I. It was way. Dodgers, but they answered Mets. They one to nothing up. chicklets. Experts, will you be doubling celebrity mashup? We sure yes. will. Yes, sir. Here we go. 35 seconds on the clock. Experts down 1 0 early. Name the two celebrities. So Michelle that, Pfeiffer and is that Leo on the? I outside? think it's Leo, Leonardo DiCaprio. He's got the widow's peak. Yep, I would say Michelle Pfeiffer. That's a nice, nice Leonardo set of hair DiCaprio. there. We're gonna go Leonardo DiCaprio, Michelle Pfeiffer. Final answer. That's correct. Nice. Come on, friends. One other side to tie it up. Expert to use their double now. Check what's thirty-five seconds. Name the two celebrities. Oh, I think the outside's Tom that's, Hanks. Tom, Tom Hanks Tom and the Hanks. girl from uh, Su- Alien, Susan, all right? Susan Sarandon. No, that's Susan Sarandon. Okay, cool. Uh, so, final answer, Susan Sarandon and Tom Hanks. That is correct, two to two. Good oh, teamwork. look at Hanks' face in that. What the fuck? Two to, oh, yeah, they doubled. Yeah, okay. Hanks taking some ricochet shots. Here we go. Next category is the NBA. The NBA. Oh, what? During the Spurs and Tim Duncan's first championship run, they swept what two C in the 1999 Western Conference Finals? Hmm. Would that be? Could it be the Rockets? No, I kind of want to double sip. I'll tell you why. There okay. was a team co- coming off being great and a team going into being great that could have been the two seats. Okay, sure. You want to double uh, sip? Yeah, we're going to double sip. All right, your first guess. Need it in five. The Jazz. Ten seconds for your second guess. Shaq's Lakers. Final answer? Yeah. Other side, yes. 15 seconds. Uh, what, I, I, maybe the Rockets, like PFT said? Um, yeah, I don't I mean, even know if they're in the West. Kings no, did they win uh, in like 95? With yeah, they won, not, they won two back-to-back when Jordan was out. I don't but, even know. I don't even know. Oh, was it the five. Kings? Were the Sacramento Kings? Yeah, I was, thinking, I was thinking them too, actually. Let's go, go. That. Say but, it. Right, final answer, Sacramento Kings. What's gonna be the fucking Blazers? Uh, uh, I mean, that's, I, I that's a question. Not. That's a really that's hard tough. question. Other Whatever, side, not ours. And they wasted a during a, a Shaq double. and Kobe's final season together. The Lakers defeated what one seed in the 2004 Western Conference Finals. Do you guys want a double answer on this no, one? No, no, we can't waste no, it because no, we don't save know. Save it for dude. when we need it. Uh, number one seed, 2004. Jesus Christ. I mean, you want to say San Antonio? Kings. What about huh? the Kings? Yeah, we just said them, and I don't think they were ever one seed. No, uh, San Antonio. No, wait you, you decide, all right. Yeah, yeah. San Antonio is a good answer. San Antonio final answer. 15 seconds, other side. Not our strength. I mean, Kings isn't a bad choice. Or um, Mavs. Could be the Spurs, right? Five. He just said the Spurs. Four. Oh, yeah. He said Spurs. Three. Good call. Idiot. Two. Dallas Mavs. Dummy. It's Kings. Wolves. Minnesota Guys, Kings. we just got oh, lucky there. The the yeah. We'll take us. Just named so many basketball teams. Yeah, we did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The only time Kevin Garnett won anything in, in Minnesota. Yep. Music. This is how this is going to work. This is uh, Brandon's not had this yet, and Chicklets hasn't had this. You're going to hear two seconds of a song. You're going to have to tell me the title of the song. It's title of the song tonight. You're going to get the year it came out, and if it's a band or an artist, you can ask to play it one more time. You can have it played two times, but the timer will not stop the second time. Here we go. This is for the experts. 
Name the title of this 1976 song based on the first two seconds. Here it is. Name the title of the song, 35 seconds. You can hear it again. Timers okay. begun, experts. I know the song. Me too, friend. But, but I, I, got don't, I don't think I know the name of it. It's can we hear real, it again? Real deep voice. Hear it again, yep. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 10 <laughs> seconds. Already knows it. Is that like taking it to the streets or something? Yeah, you. Five. I don't, four. What is it? Do it. Everyday people. Uh, yeah. Everyday people? Yeah. Final, Final answer? Yeah. Other side. Taking it to the streets. Final answer. You said that answer, Brandon. You yeah, idiot. that was kind of. And he reacted too. He reacted. I know. Oh, yeah. All right. All right. No. I know. All right. I know. Drinking the That's sweet on me. tea. I missed Red Ray's reaction. I, know, I yeah, thought yeah, yeah, Ray yeah. was Holy reacting to my shit. answer. I know he missed it. He missed it. Oh my God, Brad! That was like that could break up the experts. I thought you guys were calling him an idiot just for like the whole act of it, but this guy is actually a complete full blown moron. (laughs) What? I said the answer. I was talked out of it. That's on me. I I saw Ari's reaction. I look at the meltdown. PFT said the Spurs, and we already said the Spurs. What what are you doing tonight, dude? Jesus Christ! I'm off. I'm on the other side. Get the guy a piss test. Also, we're good. We're good. Take a guys. Let's get it here. All right, great job, buddy. Nice work. 67 song. Ooh. Oh, um, no clue. Oh, I know it too. You can no hear it again too if you want. Just let I, know. Uh, Captain Fantasy, final answer. Can you play it again, please? You're pretty fucking stupid too. You didn't know it. Nah, right. mate, I can no, only I, play it for the team that I can oh, play for the fuck, first team. I, th- I think it's me and Bobby McGee. Mm. Why didn't you play it again? Because I. Is that the name of the. I think it's me and, me and Bobby. Me and Bobby McGee. Final answer. All right, you had it. You're... Dear Mr. Fantasy, it's, I know. It was Dear Mr. Fantasy. Oh, that is correct. Dear what? Mr. Fantasy. That doesn't... Real close. Remember that one. Yeah. Next up. Oh, you yeah, didn't know about right? him. Oh, he's easy, not... Jeff. Don't fucking... Why don't you like, put salt in the wound I fucked there? up. It's all right. I'm a big Holy boy. Did Jeff yeah. yeah. just say remember host? that for later? Yeah. Oh, Could be a big God. deal. Sports I'm stadiums. The movie. Sports stadiums. Here we go. Experts, you're up. The Amway Center is one of four Florida arenas housing an Orlando. NBA or an That's NHL Orlando. team. In what's Orlando. That's Orlando. Final answer? <laughs> yes. That is you correct. Three to three. Right you just have to sell shit. You don't need to get tickets. Here we go. Other side to make it Good. four to three to regain the lead. The Chase Center is one of five California arenas housing an NBA or NHL team. In which city is it located? I... That, is it Sacramento? It, it, that one might be Sacramento. It has but, to be because it's not any of the NHL teams. They didn't yeah. change the the pavilion in uh, San Jose to anything. No, I don't think it, so. It's not. It's not LA, LA or Anaheim. Uh, so. Hey, what's the new? Um, they changed the name or they changed the stadium of uh, the Golden State Warriors. That's not it. Oh no! That I don't know. Ten they're, seconds. Yeah, they're, they're in that new arena biz. Oh shit! Uh, All right, I, would, I need something soon. All right. I th- should we go Sacramento off? Uh, n- yes, yeah, Sacramento. Final answer, Sacramento. San Jose, perhaps? I'm going back to thinking about um, Honda Captain Center Captain Anaheim. answers. Yeah. Honda Why Center was Anaheim. That? Why would you do that? I love you, Conan's, but... Need San, Ho- San Jose in. sounds good to me. San Jose. Biz was on the right track. That's San Francisco, home of the Warriors. Oh, why that hey, yeah, was, it okay, it was, right, yeah. Yeah. I mean, I would have said okay. Oakland anyways. Would Oakland have counted or no? No, because they moved no, out they of moved Oakland. It. They were in Oracle and they moved yeah, to San Francisco. Yeah, we were, we were, we were screwed were anyways. Oracle. I forgot uh, they changed the name of it. Niche category time. PFT's mic just did a weird thing. Uh, niche category time. Right. New niche category rules. Right. Right. Expert, you've had this already. Chicklets, you now pick your own. R.A. picked 1980s movies. 1980s movies. <laughs> what a team player. Fuck. <laughs> Me and Jeff don't know shit. <laughs> Experts, you picked The Cosby Show. Yep. Sure did. Oh, that's Brandon. Ooh, that's I am. Drink, drink, also. Drink. <laughs> Cosby Show. All right. Brandon, here we go. Al. I must be if your friend know it. Here's your question. Cosby Show. This Remember, this round is worth two points. You cannot use lifelines. You're allowed to use that creep show in a fucking sh- our, our the nice fuck up. Let's go. G-rated show. Like, this is bullshit. Just don't sip anything. The Cosby Show. Rudy and Peter Brady. Juice are trying to make what for two points? Juice. 
Jelly, final answer. Uh, it's correct. It's grape jelly. So that's to be more specific. You were more specific. That is correct. Five to three. This is Jello. That's a Jello question. How did they get two points? Hey, uh, like PFT, oh, PFT, 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 something happened to your mic. What's it? You're a fucking wind tunnel. Are we on yeah. an airplane right now? Just actually sounded like <laughs> like the glass of an airplane window broke up. Is PFT, PFT. doing macro dosing right now as well? <laughs> I'm jealous. PFT, you good? Yeah. You should, be locked you, up. you should be locked yeah. up with the fact that you knew that answer. Good now. You should be locked up with the fact that you knew that answer. First yeah. of all, yeah. there were 30 years before we, we knew he was raping people, okay? So in that 30 years, oh, I'm... No, all right. All right. All right. All right. We don't need to go there. And <laughs> that's the end of that. <laughs> yeah. Brandon has used his Cosby Show niche, and now we can't go back to it. Brandon's muted. So. Yeah, but exactly. I knew it. Jeff, can you we know, can we double on the two points here? Or is that no, not no, no okay. lifelines? Just trying to yep. when I go on that. All right, here we go. All right, you better movie. get this for not even asking us about niches, dude. <laughs> Nick Cage's lone movie from the 1980s, nominated for Oscars Best Picture, happened at the 60th Awards in 1988. What was it? It was nominated at the 60th Awards in 1988. What was the movie? Peggy Sue got married. Final answer. Oh my god, like not even a debate. Like, what? I, I don't know. I, 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 even I, I haven't even seen that. So, I is it know. Moonstruck? It could be Moonstruck oh, or the witches. It might be Moonstruck. I think, I think it's, it's Moonstruck. Moonstruck, guys. Unbelievable. It, Cher was in that, right? Yeah. Five. I think it's Moonstruck. Moonstruck, yeah. final answer. Big steal. It was Moonstruck. Oh, oh, seven with three. Oh, no. <laughs> All right. What would you have guessed? Yeah. All right. It's not what I guess. I thought I knew it. I'm sorry. I thought I. I thought Wait, I knew. I, it. I'm I sorry. I no. No. I was no, it's, it's, hey, phone. fuck. Hey, guys, let's fucking All get right. it together here. It's four fucking points. We could do this. No, you can't. <laughs> Chicklets, you have all of your lifelines. I want to remind you of that. Yes, exactly, boys. We're going oh, in guns a blazing just, in the end. There's still a lot, still a lot of rounds left. Here we go. Uh, time for the bonus round. Time to make the donuts. Game shows is the theme of the bonus round. Game shows. Uh -huh. R.A., your final answer person for your team. Could make it a two-point game again. Experts, Brandon, your final answer person for your team. It's like a shootout. Team with the most at the end of five rounds wins two points. Here is your question. The timer begins when I'm done reading it. In the 26 unique game shows to be nominated at the Daytime Emmy for Game uh, Show of the okay. Year. Jeopardy? Jeopardy's definitely on there, yeah. Yeah. Jeopardy. Price is right. Price is right, final answer. Wheel of Fortune. My hand up, meaning I have... Sorry. Yes, but yes, we're trying to do this methodically. Wheel yeah. of Fortune. Family Feud. I would say, okay, yeah, I was going to say Family Fine. Feud or uh, who, uh, who? Don't say anything else. Family Feud, final answer. Yeah, um, Go with what, uh, who wants to be a millionaire? Would that be daytime? It is now. Yeah. Okay, sure. Who wants to be a millionaire? Um, deal or no deal? Great call. Final answer, deal or no deal. Do you think that Weakest Link would be on there, like the reruns? I don't think so. Or maybe. I don't know. How about Let's Make a Deal? Five. Okay. Yeah. Let's Make a Deal. Check with the rest of them. All right. Um, the joke is wild. Final answer. Never heard of that. Nine to three lead for the experts. Huge. Big six-point lead through the bonus round. There's a couple on here you've definitely heard of. Yeah, I mean, it's... I, I was going to ask how long go, going back was it just in general? Twenty five years. The pyramids on there, match table. game. Oh, celebrity name I was game. Say, Cash what cab. about the square game? Cash square. Square. Yeah. Gladiators is a game. I know. I never. Nine Dude, to three. I, all lifelines available. I didn't even hear them. Are Here we go. Focus. We're good. Colleges and universities is the next category. Colleges and universities. This is hmm. for the experts. Hmm. You you. When when both teams don't know college football, college basketball, you don't get that category. That's how it goes. That's consistent with the show. That's consistent with the show. Okay. Here we go. What two states do these schools reside in? North Bradley, Carolina. High Point and oh. E-Line. North Carolina. North Carolina. What two states? Oh, High Point is. Where's I feel like Bradley is the one. Bradley's like oh, yeah. The West. They're both High Point's North Carolina, right? Yeah. So is North e Carolina. Elon's definitely North Carolina. Uh, Bradley. 
I don't know. I don't know where Bradley is. I don't know where Bradley is. It's in the Midwest. Ten seconds. It's in the Midwest. Shit. Just Indiana or Ohio. Those are my two guesses. I don't know. Five. I think Four. I think Illinois. Illinois. Maybe. Okay. Illinois, North Carolina. Damn it. That is correct. Nice. Nice. To three. nice. Other side, down seven. Here you go. What two states do these schools reside in? Sacred Heart, Quinnipiac, and Bowling Green. Two states are represented here. Connecticut and Ohio. Uh, Michigan. Bowling Green is Ohio. In no, Bowling Green is either in Kentucky or Ohio. It's in Ohio. Ohio, Ohio and Connecticut. It's in Ohio. It's Ohio and Connecticut, final answer. Ten to four, six-point game. Reminder, you have your double. You have all your lifelines. Thank you. Next category, movies. You want a double check? We got a double. We're doubling. Do Get we, first. though? Get first, though. We won't double as well. Okay, this is for the experts. Experts, this oh. is worth one point. Okay. Wong Jun Ho directed this 2013 dystopian thriller that picked up a large following, was adapted into a TNT show. None of those words make sense. Live. A TNT show. Um, dystopian thriller. It's not Good Burger. That it's TNT. Not- <laughs> Turn out to Should we call yeah. someone? Yes, call. Uh, the, what's the idiot movie guy? The other one, Ken Jack. Yeah, I'll call Ken Jack. <laughs> the okay. other idiot movie calling guy. Ken Jack. The, you guys are so lucky, a friend. You don't want to know He's gonna call anyone. Hopefully, hopefully, he's fucking playing with his Siamese cat and doesn't answer. <laughs> Why are you so low in your shot? Maybe Sit he up, man. He messed up right, with the cliche, with the yeah, because I fucked up the thing earlier. I didn't want to touch I it again. I think Nietzsche's going to be hockey in the tournament. Come on, Ken Jack. No, don't do it, Ken Jack. He's with the cat. No, he is yeah. with the cat. Yeah, that fucking cat. This is the right, turning point right, right here. Mr. Whiskers. Ken Jack. I know. Ken Jack. Right, what's the timeline on the call? Once it stops. All right. What do you mean? If it's a FaceTime. It. It'll go forever. No, no it won't. No. Come on, Ken Jack. Come on, Ken Jack. God, JFK blown away. What else do I have to say? Oh my yes. god! In Ten seconds. That's the turning point. For us? I, have, I, I, no, I don't know what it hold is. Up, all right, hold up. I'm, I'm okay. Yeah, this all right, what is it? All right, what is it? Five, four, ah, three. Don't know. Two, one. Signs. I don't know. Uh, it's us, right, Jeff? Yep. Snow is the final answer. <sighs> and can, can, can we double? For can we double? You're already double. Your, okay. your teammates doubled for you. All right. I'm 10 I'm to five. Still, make still, it 10 to seven. I'm still lost. John Favreau directed and starred in this 2014 movie in which he quits his restaurant. Oh, chef. And opens the food truck with his son. Awesome show. Great. Movie. Awesome. Final awesome. answer, chef. 10, seven. There we go. Oh, oh, Jack. oh, I can feel it. Look at how eight. Hey, hey, I hear. just, you know, everyone's seen chef. Hey. Snow Snowpiercer. Piercer. It's it's Chris if Evans. You look it's close enough. That's it? how tight their yeah. assholes are. Right now. They're puckered up, guys. My asshole is wide open. Okay. They are <laughs> wide up. open. Hey, Reminder, yeah. chickens, you have your phone, a friend, and your double sip. Yes, we do. Here we go. We are Next back. Next category loaded. is the NFL. This is for the experts. NFL. Okay, experts. All right. What former league leader in rushing yards played the final season of his career with the Baltimore Ravens in 2011? Hmm. No lifelines left for the experts. Three point. It, it could be Ricky Williams. Was he ever the league leader? Is that? Yeah, he definitely led. I, I think in 01, 02, 03. Because I remember he played for the Ravens. He tore his pec on like his second carry. Did he last all the way to 2011 though? I think he might have come back at that point. I don't hate that answer. It's probably the best answer we're going to come up with. Not Corey Dillon, right? He lasted longer anyway. Was he on the Ravens? Probably not. Go Ricky Williams. Ricky Williams, final answer. That is correct. That was a big one. It's almost like he knew it before the show was happening. Other side. Come on. Yeah. Other side. Other side. You have both your lifelines. What former league leader receiving touchdowns played the final season of his career with the Cincinnati Bengals in 2010? Taking it to the T.O. I'm so – I mean – I mean, I'm. Ocho Cinco. Do you have someone that knows NFL that we can call? I, I got who, a guy. Who are you calling, R.A.? One of my good pals. Oh, NFL, R.A. Not, I mean, about, do you have Stephen Che's number? I will give you Stephen Che's number. Hey. Oh, I have his number. Oh no, I, I don't. I do. I have Stephen Che's number. Can we have his number? 
I have it. Do you want to call Shay? Yes, he's all there. Right, let's, let's, all right, let's do it. All right, hold on. Your buddy from Charlestown ain't gonna know this. I didn't say he was from Charlestown, Peck ahead. Where is he from then, Revere? <laughs> no, not from Revere. We're gonna assume he didn't have one friend outside of fucking Charlestown. Seriously, guy, <laughs> fucking. Come on, right, Shay will right. know this. Who? Taking it to the first. Steve, all right. Recall who? Stephen Shea? Oh. The worst call a friend in the history of the show. I thought he knows football. I thought he did too, brother. He's a loser, actually. All right, so we're going to – all right, Jay, we're going to do Jay? I thought you already called him. I could, <laughs> call, yeah, him. Yeah, hey, I could, I, I could call Chris Long. Is that a good one or no? It went right Brody. to voicemail, so fucking – Oh, oh. That means oh, that, that, that would assume that means he's on a flight. All right, you have 10 seconds. All right, need an answer. Fucking, you know what? Why don't you say fucking what you said already? What, no, Long. it's not T.O. No. All right. All right, all right, okay, I need uh, it. All right. All right, Terrell Owens, final answer. Ah! That is correct. Ah! Oh! 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 You know he was on a flight, Stephen J? Fuck no. We wasted – no, obviously not. We wouldn't have wasted a fucking life. He's not asking. That might have been the baby. craziest Brandon. question. I'm looking at the best for the Did wit. You know Tay's on his flight right now? Great, great guess, and we're in this, guys. We are in yeah, this. we are. Do we have hockey coming up? I didn't know, and I didn't care no. because he literally – I wanted them to call him. He's terrible. He is right. bad. He's bad. All right. We're not done Next yet. category is retail and shopping. Oh, we got a woman. Oh, Biz, this is uh, you, bud. Yeah, oh. this is me. I got, Biz, I cross those legs for this question. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna tuck my, <laughs> I'm gonna tuck my dick into my ball or my ass too. All right, everybody, relax. Here we go. There are six points left. Three point lead. Hermes. Designer brands owns and operates this chain of footwear and fashion stores with over 500 locations in the United States. Is that Shoe Carnival? Designer brands. <laughs> Payless. Footwear and fashion stores. Is Payless still a thing? I saw Payless. Yeah. Oh no, that was in that was in the Virgin Islands. Oh, well, that um, exists. That's a place. But this is in the United States. I guess at U.S. Virgin oh, Islands. Um, Five hundred hmm. locations. Eat something in. So like like Five, TJ Maxx or something? Four, no, I don't think three, that two, Payless, one. Other side, fifteen seconds. I mean, what it's like either Aldo or like Foot Locker or like something. I mean, footwear can be shoes or sneakers. Fashion, fashion stores, well, fashion could be you know it's just clothes. I mean, uh, this is the, I literally I have. I mean, do you want to say Aldo nothing. because yeah, Aldo, I mean a Aldo is not a terrible answer. It's a right. big chain of uh, of two, foot two, distributors. Right, go Aldo. Final answer, Aldo. Aldo. DSW, DSW, the general. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. Right. Fuck, uh, yeah, that was no shame other side. Work. That question's impossible. I mean, does DSW store, do they sell anything but shoes? That's what they, that, they have, I don't make that's their mission. Brandon gets his shoes. You can sell belts. Have, 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 have we been able to? Of, I did think of DSW and I eliminated it in my mind because they don't sell clothes. Oh, you're yeah, the best. They, 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 they do. I know they sell belts too, for sure. And shirts. Uh, well, belts. Yeah. They, do belts. Sell. they do sell Fashion clothes. Vague, though. Huh. So, Other side. so right. do, do we get to, we've already tried a double, correct? Yeah, you, you have your yeah. double sips. We, you can't answer one of these final three uh, questions twice. Here we go to make it 11 9. This rewards program from Kohl's allows shoppers online and stores a chance to earn $10 for every 50 spent. Brandon seems to know it. What the fuck is this shit? To get this guy. What's he the doing, fuck? dude? What's he doing? Like, turn he the knows the answer. He knows it. Because he does all the shopping at Kohl's. What well, the fuck is Kohl's? It's, <laughs> I, I it's no, no idea. Though. This is like the rewards program. So we need to know the name of the like. See, like, what the fuck? The cool this is a I fucking father shop. Yeah, this is lame. You're the best. You're the best. Okay, baller. Brandon goes back to school shopping for Tommy this... at Coles and knows the answer. <laughs> this we're done. We have nothing. We literally don't even have an answer. All right, you have nothing. I need something in five. All right. Um, rewards program. What? Two. The cash back well, rewards. Say two cash for one. Rewards. Two for I don't one. Say. Cash back Coles. I don't know. What is it Cole's cash? Isn't it Cole's cash, cash, right? Cole's cash. I think it's just Cole's cash. Cole's yeah, cash. I think so too. Fuck. Final answer. That's yeah. correct. I'm fucking done with this. Worst show ever. I'm never. This is I'll why we don't come, come on this come show. On you fucking. This is only your second. You won the last one. <laughs> that question. Those two questions. 
Whoever decided retail and shopping and thought of those two questions should be shot. Listen, don't go play against me. Go, it go was, pick another team. Of, it was Gooch and that he's behind the scenes and, and feel TFD good about it. Stroked them off before the show frauds. All right, boys, we got to You're still alive. Yeah, we got to answer the next Fraudulent team probably for the experts. TV, TV. What actress has this TV filmography? Freaks and Geeks, ER, and Dead to Me. This is for the game, but if not, Chicklet's still alive. So thinking back to Freaks and Geeks. Was uh, was Christina Applegate in Freaks and Geeks? Oh, she might have been. Was she in ER? Or is it the girl that played... Do uh... you guys remember the... Fuck, what's her name? Was she Franco's... plays Velma. She plays Velma in Scooby-Doo. In the live action Scooby Doo, uh, need the answer in five, four, three. I don't know. Two. Christina, Christina Applegate. One. All right, you know it. A final answer, Linda Cardellini. Yeah, it's twelve hell. to nine. Not over yet, Linda That's Cardellini. Boy, right. And who else? That's who boy, played right. Velma in the live action? Did uh, make it twelve to ten. <laughs> what actress is this TV <laughs> filmography? <laughs> Ally McBeal, Thirty Rock, and Unbreakable Kimmy Schmidt. Final answer, Jane Krakowski. It's 12 to 10. Two point game with two points remaining. Final round. Come on, Rear. Is NHL next? No, there's no NHL. No, there's, there's, there's only no one, college there's only football one for niche. Brandon. There's no NHL for you guys. That's how it evens out. Here we go. Let's steal here, boys. Cars. Cars is the final category. You're going to oh, see a picture of a car. Oh, it's a I blank car. You tell me the company that one. makes the car. All you get is a picture. This is for the experts. You get this, you win the game. It's over. Name also chicklets. If you make it to your question, you have your double sip. You can answer it two times. What company makes this car? Experts for the win. That looks. I think it looks like a Subaru. a Subaru. It looks like a Subaru to me. It does have that roundish. I my gut instinct says Subaru. I thought Subaru when I saw you it. You both I've thought, got a, thought Subaru. I thought nothing. So I've got I'm a gonna, backup guess, but I don't want to say it. No, that because. I'm going to say Subaru then. Yeah. Final answer. That is correct. Experts have won the game. Last guess, last category for Chicklets. What car no, company? The, that's a Mercedes. No, that's a um, Mercedes. A Mercedes. No, it's a uh, logo. My mom has one. Fuck. Scoba, Scoba or something? I mean, it's a circle logo, so it's either is BMW it a Kia or Mercedes. Or something? I think. I, I, your mom has a Kia. You can't buy her a Mercedes? I. I. But it, I mean, we're lost. I, think it's, I think it might be it might be a Mercedes, but it seems too easy of an answer. What are you saying, Ari? I'm saying I said Mercedes from the jump, but I already blew this game. So, oh guys, don't worry about it. It's okay. No, you got to spike into it. Jeff sucks. Final answer, Mercedes. Ben. Have you guys ever seen a Mercedes before? Uh, yeah. Anthony, what's your guess? What's your I guess? I think it's a Mazda. A Mazda. Final answer. It was a Mazda. Diz was right. That's a they Mazda. Said that right, it said Mercedes. No, no, I said no, I started I, with I, I Mazda. Mazda. I, did. I, I, yeah. Uh, I don't no. think I've ever seen a car that looks Whit, less like a Whit, Mercedes state, or a state BMW. of the game. Wit thoughts. You're going to be in the playoffs. We got. Oh, that was it. Thought it was. It's fourteen. One of the worst run games I've ever seen in my I life. I blew it. No, I <laughs> How am I getting the blame for this? Uh, hand up, hand up. I blew. I blew. I mean, I the, fucked, the the the, the, the blown up. niche was the difference. Would have been no, the was. blown niche was it, big, but just it, no, like it's huge. Those, I, I, and, I, and, I, and then allowing Brandon to use that scumbag in jail, old miserable prick Cosby. It's like that was crazy. So many things that happened. It's just upsetting. That question was about Keisha Knight Pulliam and the actor that played Peter. It had nothing to do with in the Cosby Show. As you spit food out of your mouth, that was a terrible fucking question. I'm trying to eat healthy. Okay. Hey, you know what my niche my category my, my, my niche category is gonna be fucking Ted Bundy next episode. <laughs> Do it. Do it. <laughs> also, Bill Cosby's not in jail anymore. They let him I wasn't the, I was Kelly. not the same after that moment. Uh, I was hey, in his pocket the rest I of the show. I, hand up, I blew it. I I my niche thing. I didn't I read the fucking thing wrong. I I, I So I, what I, seat I, are we, Jeff? Are we I'm like struck. Oh, we're, we're in. Right. Right. You guys are in the plane. Teams miss the playoffs in this game? No, you played twice. No. Like six or seven teams are not getting in. But there's gonna us. be there's I, I won't name names. There's a couple teams who played like eight times who are not getting in the tournament over you guys. So they're pretty upset. But you're in. You're gonna be between a ten or a thirteen seed. I don't know right now. They'll we didn't even it. use one of our lifeline. <laughs> didn't yeah. I, I uh, boys <laughs> uh, boys. We win as a team. We lose. All right. All right. You also answered like. 80% of our questions. Yeah, well, whatever, but, you all suck. You mean to tell I, me they... I when it counted. 
They went one and one, and they're going to get a 10 through 13 seed? They have a massive fan vote. What am yeah, I going to say? Fans are idiots. Yeah. <laughs> they can, like they have a big the game podcast. Notes, always Jeff wants viewers from Canada, Brandon. We can't all have Mississippi fucking scumbags watching <laughs> your episodes. Uh, R.A., you're going to be in New York, I know for sure. Yes. Chicklets, you'll be in the tournament. <laughs> When's the tourney, Jeff? When's the tourney? May 16th through 18th. Oh, yeah, right in the heart of playoffs. Okay, I, I, I might be able to be there then. I'm going to pull an all night. Biz, Biz we assume you can't. You're the, you're the big star on TV. Now, no. wait, if you can swing it, we'd love to have you. I'm coming <laughs> in. I'll, we'd I'll love to have you. You're all we'll invited. We'd love to have you there. Though. I'm not wearing that jersey. What I'm jersey? actually looking forward to that because – bowling jersey. Was no, this jersey. Jersey. it's completely pink. It's great. Oh, okay. Chicklets guys during playoff season are not what you'd say. Like, they don't have fresh brains at that point. Hey, not to be like – like, Biz is going to be exhausted. He's probably going to do, like, three live streams in a week. The experts <laughs> must be worried about PFT, though. Maybe one of the worst performances of oh, his stop. Oh, my Cut it out. Listen, was great. I see why you're what not What do you mean he spoke off the question? I, PFT was going to go. Mental warfare. I just want to under the bus if, left and right just because you don't have Crosby to bail you out. Whatever, you know, like, team. six or seven seed shows up, if Wit is there in person, good luck. I don't know. If I can't answer a question, what, it Good doesn't luck. matter what I can Yeah, but this in-person rattling people is, is a whole different ballgame. Uh, thank you, Chicklets, for playing. You're in the tournament. We'll see you soon. Expert, you've been in for a while. You end your season 15 and 6. We're off for a week if you're watching us. Got to write a fuckload of questions. The Congrats dozen trivia you. tournament Good presented Jeff. by High Thank you for the tournament. It's the next thing you're going to see. Selection Tuesday is coming up next week. You'll see the bracket revealed. Thank you for Don't watching. Worry, Twitter episodes. We'll see you back. Some questions right. for yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was right, going to say, good luck in your brainstorming, PFT. Right.